Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Aki, and today we have a very special unboxing for you guys. So stay tuned. I don't have to party to have fun, you see. I got different hobbies, and that's all I need. It's a huge box. So let's open it. So I'm super excited to open it. I don't know if I'm doing it correctly or not. I think I am. Yay! Ooh, well cushioned, well cushioned. I always like to keep these for my bags to stuff them in. Because these make excellent cushions. boxes so I got two pairs both in a seven and a half from the brand Aqua Taylor I've actually had this before so um, I had a pair and I love them so much that I pretty much wore them every day and then that's why I need to get new pairs for shoes and then they were having a huge sale so I was like once a better time so it comes with this let me make sure that it's not in French. It's waterproof, excellent for Toronto winter and fall conditions. Comes with a little dust bag for your shoes. So if you're traveling, it's easier to carry. Let's put this here. And then... Wow, this is like really well cushioned. So this is used to like um wipe off any of the marks so it's used to clean your shoes so my first pair these i have a similar pair right now to these but um this is actually in navy blue there's a little special with a pointed toe and a little bit of a heel so i'm excited to try these on this is the first pair let's put it back now let me show you the second one Also in size seven and a half. Comes with the card and the big as well. Ooh, but these are beautiful. These are in black and this is leather. Ooh, they feel so nice. I'm so excited. And then it has like a little buckle here and then a zip for here. So that's wow. Oh. Ooh. One thing let me show you. The base. Very important thing about winter shoes. Gotta have these like tracks, I guess you can call them. Don't know what they were called. But these make sure that it that you don't split pretty much. And it's really, really important. So this is always a tip i guess this is a tip when looking for winter shoes you want these these traction things hope you can see them yeah and there you have it brand new shoes hmm this is how i look with these boots on so they look really good with jeans just skinny jeans they also look really good actually with like dress pants as well so these are the navy blue ones, and the, this is the same outfit with the leather ones. As you can see, they have zippers in these ones, but the other ones don't. So it's a little bit easier to put on these ones. So, new box. 
Next thing I got. This is so exciting. I've been so excited about this for so long. Can't believe it's finally here. So, I got the Urban Decay setting spray. So this is the all nighter long lasting makeup setting spray. So I'm super super excited to try. This is actually in the mini version. There's a bigger version, but I got the miniature version just to try it out. And then I got the Lancome foundation. This is the Kent Idol. I don't know how to pronounce this. Idol Tian Tent Idol Ultra Wear foundation. So these two, I'm really, really, really excited to try because I saw that but a professional uh, makeup artist use these two on um, a like a I guess get ready kind of video, and this um, makeup artist is very famous for working on like Korean idols makeup. So she was using these two products together. So this as a foundation and this as like a setting spray, and then. It looked amazing, so I'm really, really, really excited to try these two. And then I also got a tinted um, sunscreen, I guess? Tinted sunscreen. This is the Shiseido Urban Environment Tinted UV Protector Sunscreen. Um, I was using a different one before, but I feel like that one was kind of clogging my pores and I didn't feel too good after using it for a long time so I thought I needed a new one um that one is actually just um, an Aveeno basic sunscreen but I think it was a little bit too thick actually for my skin so my, 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 my skin couldn't really breathe so I felt like it was clogging my pores which is why I wanted to get a new one um one thing to note is that I've always used Shiseido I thought I'd try something new with the Aveeno one but it didn't like my skin didn't feel very good after that so i went back to shishado but um one thing to note is that normally i just use the general um basic sunscreen face sunscreen is it that is that what you want like sunscreen for your face from shishado this is the first time i've ever used a tinted version so i'm very excited to try and i feel like now with like covid and that we're always wearing masks right so i don't really put on foundation or even like really like CC cream or BB cream or anything because like I feel like what's the point if it's your mask is going to rub it off right so I've been generally just using um sunscreen so I think like with this tinted one it would be interesting to try because like it'll give you a little bit of cover but it won't be like it won't be a it won't be too much so I'm really excited to try this Last but not least, um, my last item for my unboxing, um, I realized that when I first shot this and I did the unboxing, I lost the video. So I, I, this is like a reshoot. So um, I got the Arctrix Atom SL. So this is meant to be a middle layer. Um, it is in the color um, Coral Red, I believe. So it's a orangey reddish tone. This is the front. One thing I wanted to show you is the cool pockets. So like, as you can tell, this is like really well sealed in. So if it rains or anything, like it's, you're good. Let me just turn this around for you guys. This is how it looks at the back. And a detail for the hood is this. So if you can if you if you feel like the loose the hood is too loose you can pull this and it will tighten it so it fits perfectly on your head and that it won't come off it's actually a really really good hood when i first initially tried this i was actually really shocked so one thing that's really cool about this jacket is that it's windproof and waterproof but it's also breathable so if you can tell that it's two different types of material right in here and this part makes sure that it um, gives you that um, breathable um, air. And also, um, the sleeves are unique as well. Like, it tightens at the end, so nothing can come in or out of it. So it 
keeps you very protected but um this is meant to be a um, middle layer so you wear this and then you have the um shell that you wear on top of that and this is i don't think gore-tex material i think the shell would be but i don't think this is gore-tex material but this is uh we'll, we'll focus nylon insulating and 100 percent polyester and it's lined with line nylon but I'm going to be using this for my hikes. So I'm just putting on this jacket on top of what I would normally wear to go hiking. So I have my Lululemon hiking pants. So these are my, one of my favorite leggings actually. And then I'm just wearing a black t-shirt underneath. Uh, put the jacket on. That's what it looks in the back. Front without it zipped. Side. And as you can tell, it comes straight down to my arm pants. And if I get cold, I can actually put it in and then it out too and I'm just gonna zip it up for you one thing I really like about this is how lightweight it actually is it feels warm but it's super duper lightweight if I zip it all the way up this is how it looks like zipped up it looks pretty good right with the black and then also what I also like about this is even if you're not hiking this is a great jacket just to have when you're traveling. Even if it's more warm than cold, like having a jacket just in case is also always good, right? And it's so light and easy to pack. You can always throw it in your bag or backpack or whatever when you're traveling. You don't even notice that it's there because of the weight. It's like so light. I'm just going to show you the hood. So as you can tell, it fits perfectly. Like you're, you know for a fact like your hood's not coming off like it fits your head perfectly in the back in the front like right now i feel really good but if you want were to tighten it it's not hard you just kind of pull this at the back and it gives you a tighter feel for your hood like when it's really windy and like it's also a water resistant right so this is perfect, especially like in Canada in the winter. Like I feel like I'm going to be wearing this a lot. Like it's just a good overall, like a good piece to have, even if you're not hiking all the time. But it's just, it's just so cute too. Like you can always like wear it with a pair of jeans and I feel like it'll look good, so. My last bag. So I would like to end the vlog here. Uh, if you like the vlog today, please give me a like. If you haven't subscribed and would like to, please click the subscription bell below and I will see you later. Bye!